If you take the whole spectrum of raw materials from agriculture, from minerals, from forest products, ETC, the loss to Africa is massive. We, the raw materials producers, need to conduct internal struggles in our respective countries to add value to these raw, ma raw materials, including coffee, so that we earn more from our sweat and create more jobs for our youth instead of dying in the Mediterranean, Mediterranean going to, to Europe. We also need to sensitize our partners in the countries that have been buying our raw materials at same slave prices, that their economics is defective. What will the USA or Europe or Asia lose if Africa sells added value coffee to them instead of the raw materials of the raw material form and earn more money? What if the value addition is done to other raw materials like copper, gold, iron ore, lithium, ETC? Money to Africa would mean higher purchasing power for Africa. I would like to propose to include in our declaration supporting a united and coordinated promotion of African coffee and fair price for the product at the global market as well as requesting and encouraging international coffee trading companies to support coffee producing African farmers technically and financially in the value addition process. I would like to express my total agreement with you, Mr. President, when you talked about uh, the other uh, wealth and resources that Africa has. What applies to coffee, what we are trying to do to coffee applies to the other raw materials that we have. The Download the app on App Store or Google Play Store now. Vision Digital Experience, the future of media.